Hi Gemini, welcome to your May 2020 reading. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon if you haven't already done that. And remember that this is a general reading. So take from it what you can and allow other things to pass. Uh, the roles can be reversed here and um, timing is fluid. So let's see what's coming up for you, Gemini, for the month of May 2020. Show me clearly, Spirit. We have a King of Pentacles. We have the Card of Justice. There is a Nine of Swords. All right, there's a Nine Knight of Swords. All right. There is an Eight of Swords. And there is the Six of Wands. So just give me a moment, uh, Gemini. So I feel, you guys, that you all are ready to take some uh, bold movements uh, uh, in your uh, bold steps in your life. And I also feel that you are having some very fertile thoughts with regards to what you need to do next or where you should be headed. And uh, with your cards, they're suggesting that you need to be... Um, a little more prudent here considering the times you are in i do understand this dynamic energy that's flowing within you and that's making you want to achieve so much at one go but uh, the the times are also telling you to be careful about any decision you make right now um, also uh, the eight of swords is telling you you might end up uh, getting stuck with uh, making some kind of investment making a payment to someone or making a big purchase so be very careful with regards to that, uh, Gemini. I'm also feeling that you are not going to like this feeling when I say just take a few steps back and uh, recalculate your steps because um, you're going to feel quite tired and bored and mentally you, you're going to feel that, you know, um, this isn't how you planned your life or this isn't how you wanted things to happen around you. And uh, for once, you may even feel just uh, to allow everything to just go down the drain and not take any more steps further but try and understand that this is only going to help you see a very good um, outcome of a very good um, decision uh, you've made right now with not taking your plans ahead in time uh, because some kind of monetary expenditure you were going to make or you were thinking about doing for some time has uh, been saved from losses you have been saved from losses gemini also, I feel that um, this this feeling is going to be temporary and it is not going to disturb you for a long time. So uh, just take a few time moments off uh, your routine. Um, maybe it is going to be a little difficult for you, but just take some time off and reevaluate everything you wanted to go ahead with because there are going to be some new opportunities presented to you uh, towards the end of the month and uh, right in the center or middle of the month that is 15th around 15th 13th 15th 17th like that you could get this idea you could get these brilliant ideas about how to source or do things from the sources and people around you so and then you will understand the blessings of the first 15 days of the month that did not allow you to go ahead and make or take any big actions I also feel that in the coming months, you're going to work on these ideas that are appearing to you in the second half of the month of May. And you're going to see some very great results, amazing results. Uh, that's for you, our Gemini. So let's see. Let's draw some more cards and see what's coming up for you. I also feel that you're going to feel a little discontented and dis uh, detached from those around you, especially from a loved one, like a spouse, uh, a partner in marriage or a companion and uh, that's that's going to be because you need some time off to think about yourself and you're going to go into the hermit mode so even before the card came out i spoke about you going um and into this uh, introspective mode or taking some time off from people around you and uh, going in so you could even go ahead and learn some kind of a spiritual modality or pursue a spiritual plan um, and this is going to pay off in the month of May. Amazing. Wow. 
So the card of the magician is saying that the, with the energy that you enter the month of May, you are going to gain so much when you're coming out of this month and entering into the next month that you're going to be very, very happy about your progress, about your mental abilities that will increase. So Gemini, you'll need to take the, these um, few um, things, uh, suggestions I have just offered to you and not go ahead and um, make any bold moves in the first half of the month. However, in the second half or towards the end of the month, you will realize how your energies have been changing and guiding you in the right direction and preventing you from making any wrong moves. So I hope this reading helps you all guys Do comment and let me know how these energies are playing out with you. Especially with the card of the magician is appearing here, you can expect some miraculous ideas or some fabulous openings in your life, Gemini. So keep um, on looking out for that and do comment and let me know what came up for you. And also when you listen to this reading at the beginning of the month, it might uh, not make so much sense to you. But as you're entering it, you've lived half the month and uh, towards the end of the month, if you listen to this again, you will realize the energies that you've just crossed and what is uh, about to come up. So wishing you all much love and light, Gemini. And uh, please give this reading a thumbs up if this resonates with you. Bye-bye.